We are back in the North Dakota Today kitchen and we are ready to get things started here. We have a couple of different things to try out, Heidi. We do, and uh, the big ingredient is zucchini, of course, and I'm just giving them away right <laughs> out of my ears, all the zucchini I gave you one. I gave five away the other yes. day. And, and they weren't small. No, I'm scared to go <laughs> see what the uh, garden contains today. Uh, so we're making zoodles because that's probably one of the best things you could probably do with that besides maybe grilling a zucchini. Yep. And so um, zoodles it is. It's, I guess it's somewhat healthier yeah. than you know yep. zoodles. And so I made some the other day, a little bit different than the contraption, but uh, go ahead and you start with your zucchini. Important to have <laughs> to make zoodles. Be careful with the knife though, Chris. Yes, yeah, so you're going to cut through it. We already and I don't it magic. Did. Yes, it's already been cut because I didn't want to screw that up on air. So you just take your uh, zucchini, cut it into a big chunk, and then we're going to move over here to your handy contraption. Yep, and so you just put it in there. I'm sure there's a nice ledge. Mm -hmm. And what we're going to do. Keep going. Yeah, do you want to put the bowl yeah. underneath? That no. would be great. I'll try to catch. And so, but it's just going to kind of circulate them out. I guess like an apple peeler. In a yeah. Way. I remember just, making, I can't remember what my mom would make with the apples, but we had this like apple spiral thing. Yep. Yeah, I think kind of like that. And you just keep going. It's kind of therapeutic in a way. I know. And look at those. Make such. Yeah. And then I made these the other day. I used a cheese grater and that worked. It just wasn't like the long spaghetti. It was a little bit shorter. Uh -huh. um, but yeah, use your zucchinis because we, you know, we all need something to do with them. I know when they come, when they yeah, come then, in batches of like twenty, you can't like <laughs> you can't make twenty yeah. loaves of zucchini bread. So and then you remove the core, and then you're good to go. And then yeah. so I think you just put this in boiling water for like a minute or two, cook it, yeah, and call it good. Uh, besides, if you don't have one of these fancy contraptions, there are other options. Yep, yep. So find these at Walmart. Just spin it around, all sorts of good things. Yeah. So there we are. We have made it all at the beginning of a healthy dinner for tonight. <laughs> Put some tomato sauce on there. That goes good with homemade tomato sauce. Absolutely. By the way, which are coming in. Stay with us. I'm going to have your seven day forecast coming up.